wants you to know what type of photonic fight club is happening inside of your body. So let's get into the five major interactions, shall we? Number one, let's talk about coherent scatter, the useless bitch of radiation physics. What is it? Low energy photon tickles an outer shell electron. No ionization, no drama. Just a directional change and zero purpose. This happens below 10 keV and it produces fog on the image like a ghost fart. Here's how you're gonna remember it. Coherent, confused. Shows up, spins around, does nothing productive. Compton scatter, the public menace. It's mid energy photon used in diagnostic imaging, smacks into an outer shell electron and knocks it out. Photon gets deflected like a pinball. Bill has energy, that equals scatter, equals bad image, equals dose. To the patient and you, it happens in soft tissue, contributes to occupational dose, that's you. It's why you wear lead and you run away when it's time to take a portable image. Remember, Compton equals chaos. The meth head with a slingshot. And photons everywhere, hitting the wrong targets. Photoelectric effect. The golden child. Oh, energy photons. Hits an inner shell electron. Usually a K shell. Photon gets absorbed completely. An electron is ejected. That's ionization. The resulting cascade of electrons makes the image pop with contrast. Most likely in bone. High atomic number equals high photoelectric absorption. Photoelectric. Curly white bone contrast, baby. But beware, it also increases patient dose. Why? Because more absorption equals less transmission equals the body eats the photons for breakfast. Next, pair production, the overachiever that shows up to the wrong party. It requires photon energy of at least 1.02 MeV. A photon gets yeeted into the nucleus, splits into an electron plus a positron. This only happens in radiation therapy, not diagnostic radiography. So here's your little tip. Answer on one of your questions is pair production. It's probably not that one. Don't pick that one. Pair production. Two's a crowd, and this crowd ain't at your registry. Remember, it's too strong for your little 120 kVp chest x-ray. Five, photo disintegration is the nuclear annihilator. Very strong energy, slams into the nucleus, blows it up like it owes it money. Ron gets ejected, absolutely not in diagnostic radiography, more of a nuclear medicine or therapy level event. Photo disintegration equals full gone psycho causing a nuclear breakdown. The registry wants you to know it exists, but it's probably not the answer to one of your questions. Okay, do you want a mnemonic? Sure. Crazy crackheads produce perfect panic. Coherent equals confused scatter. Mountain equals chaos plus scatter plus dose. Electric, image contrast. Pair production, positron party. The only. Photo disintegration, nick nuke. Therapy only. So the next time a test question asks you which interaction increases contrast, photoelectric, like it's your safe word. If it's about occupational dose, Compton, the delinquent photon. You see MEV anywhere in the question, the trap, that's therapy land. And remember your interactions, otherwise they'll interact with your GPA. 